Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I cannot believe it is January 14th already and I am bringing you my first new in clothing haul. I have some really really cute and cosy pieces to show you guys so let's get into it. If you haven't already go and get yourselves a nice cup of tea and let's have a cosy little catch up and let me show you guys what I picked up. Is there anything? Is there anything better than a nice cup of tea on a cold day? The weather today, I'm just looking out the window guys, is a bit gloomy. The blue sky has been popping in and out, but then it's gone quite grey. I really just, I don't mind it being cold, but I like it when it's like crisp blue skies and cold. When it's like dull and grey and rainy, I don't know, just not. Not what you want, is it really, in January? I don't mind being cold, but like when it's raining and it's cold and it's dark at like one o'clock, so not the vibe, but hey, I am bambling on again. So when it came to January and outfits that I'm wearing, I pretty much am a cozy girl all January. I'm pretty much a cozy girl a lot of the time anyway, but especially in January, it's cold. I'm mainly doing dog walks, I'm going to work, going for coffee, but staying nice and cozy and warm. So I picked these pieces up from In The Style and New Look, they were very kindly gifted. I'm working with them over my Instagram, so I thought, you know what, I'm going to show you guys them too, because there are some really, really cute finds, including this jumper. How gorgeous is this little jumper? I don't know how much you can see. It's lovely, isn't it? I love the stripes. It's not like a, it's not like a black black, it's more of like a charcoal, like it's got the hint of that deep 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 grey black if that makes any sense and I just love the way it says Paris I think it's really really cute I like the lettering I like the colour it's not like it's not a white it's like an off-white so I think it worked really really well with like the charcoal grey black so yeah I just picked up some really nice and cute cosy pieces because I just want to be cosy I just January is cosy season for me it just is so let's get into it Let's start off with what I deem as an essential in your capsule wardrobe. A lot of these pieces are actually going to slide right on into my capsule wardrobe, which is amazing. But this, it, please ignore the jeans. I styled it with jeans before, so these, these jeans are just on the hang with it. But this is an all black coat from New Look. This is absolutely gorgeous. As you'll see on the try on clips, it is fabulous. It just does the part. It's a style of coat, never give out a style. It's formal, but it can be it can be done. It can be made to look informal, casual. The way I style it really differs on the vibe of the outfit I'm going for, where I'm going. I would wear this over this what I've got on today. I've got leggings on this jumper. I'll put a big pair of boots on for dog walking, and then this over the top. And it just makes me feel a little bit more put together, a bit more elevated rather than just sometimes my big massive you know puffer coat, and I feel like you can't see the shape and stuff. So sometimes I like to put that over, but then I do dress it up and wear it more formally with like a nice jumper jeans. <laughs> Excuse me. No. And I will dress it up and have it with like jeans, a jumper, a t-shirt, a shirt, boots, a nice handbag if I'm going for lunch or something. Just feel like you're missing out if you don't have one of these in your wardrobe. I have actually got two. I've got a Karen Millen coat that is divine. But the style of that is slightly different. It is a, got like a fittedness around the waist, so it kind of really shows off your figure, which is absolutely gorgeous. But sometimes you want to go for more of like a casual, oversized look. This is definitely the coat to go for. I actually did size up. I got this in a size 14, and it gives me just the right amount of oversizedness. Oversizedness? I don't know. Oversizedness that I need and that I want for the looks. So yeah, I absolutely love this. Such a good classic, and the material is lovely. Next, I went for something I am shocked that I didn't have in my wardrobe, which is a pair of grey trousers. I got these in the tall range. New look do the tall range too, which is amazing. I need tall size fittings, especially in pants. Jumpers I can normally just size up and get away with, but pants I cannot get away with it unless they are a longer length pants. But these are just absolutely gorgeous. Got pocket detail in there, which is so nice. You have a belt round too. These are just a lovely pair of trousers. I am really looking forward to styling these and playing with, like I said again, the dressing down, dressing up. I feel like you can really 
play with these trousers like that. I feel like they are very versatile. So I'm looking forward to doing that. I have actually styled these with a jumper. I'll show you, it's very casual that I've styled them right the way down. I think it looks great. So yeah, I'm really happy with these and I like the colour too. They've almost got like, they're like a grey, but I don't know if it's these lights or something, but it does kind of look like they've got like an undertone of like a bluey grey, I don't know, but they are lovely. I have been obsessed with the colour navy blue since last September. I just seen the navy blue Uggs and I fell in love with them. And ever the navy blue lately, I've just been like, I love, I just love navy blue. And then I've seen this on their look. I think this looks so much more expensive. It was really, really cheap. It was under £30, I am pretty sure. I will include the price for you guys, but I am sure it was under £30. It just looks so expensive, I think. And it's like a really good knit. I love the white stitching down there. It kind of reminds me of like Totem. Sorry, I couldn't turn it right, but it does kind of give me those Totem vibes. Just a really cute jumper. I did size up in this and I've gone for the medium. I am not, well I am a size 8, but in jumpers I do tend to size up because I do like them longer because sometimes I will wear them like this with leggings and I won't tuck them in, I'll have them out. So I just like the little bit of length sometimes. But yeah, this is a gorgeous knit. I like the high neck on it. I just think it's lovely. It's classic, it's simple and it can slide right on into the capsule wardrobe. I've been trying to shop as consciously as I can to make sure that I'm not just following trends and going on the hype that we sometimes see on Instagram and stuff, I want to buy pieces that I can wear and rewear and restyle so many different ways. And I feel like I've done well so far with buying new in pieces and picking pieces. I feel like all of these really, mainly this lot, is are going to be really good in my capsule wardrobe. This. Why did no one ever tell me that I needed a grey zipper body? I didn't know how versatile a grey zipper body is. I styled this with the grey trousers and this little black top. I actually I've got this now too. But I styled it, I had it open with this, the coat over, and my Nike, Nike Panda, are they? Nikes? I'll show you them in a minute. You'll see them in the try-on clip. But it just looks so effortless, so kind of just given like off-duty model vibes. I really, really enjoyed this look. I just didn't know how versatile a grey hoodie could be. It's not, we're not, you know, inventing the wheel with any of these pieces here, guys. They are very basic pieces. I really am pleased with this. This is actually a men's hoodie. I couldn't find them on the New Love Women, so I went to the men's section because the men only have stuff like this. Men's size small. Fits great. And then I got this, just a classic, like, knitted top. It is actually gorgeous. It feels so soft. It feels lovely on, too. But I got in a size 10. I was scared with me being tall that sometimes the torso can come up a bit short and I wanted this to fit nice and be able to tuck into things and not come out of the jeans and stuff. So yeah, I just, I just really think it's cute. Cute little basic piece, but once again, capsule wardrobe. Now this is, I think this is so cute. This might not be for everyone, just a plain zip up, like long lip jumper, but I really, really enjoyed this. I like the neck, I like the zip detailing, very minimal. And I like the fact that it's got the slit up the sides there too. I just think it's such a nice jumper. I am a neutrals girly, which is strange because, well, it's not strange, sorry. I've also called grey not a neutral man. Oh, goodness me. But I am a neutrals girly. And I'm normally beiges. I wear a lot of black anyway. I've always wore a lot of black. And I'm like beige, black, a bit of brown. But lately I have been in my grey era. I don't know where it's come from, but I've been obsessed with grey, as you can tell, this haul. But yeah, this is just a gorgeous, neutral jumper. It's really long. Let me see what size I've got in this. Do, do, do. A size small, and it fits like a dream. Love it. It's going to be so nice with just like leggings like this, with dog walking days, just for going for coffee, catching up with friends. Love it. So now we're going to move on to the pieces that I picked up from In The Style. There's only a few, so we'll get to these quite quick. But I picked up a tracksuit so this is i've got the matching joggers with it this is just a basic gray in my gray era again gray tracksuit this actually fits so lovely i got the jumper in a size eight and it's quite oversized so i didn't need to size up in this it fit fabulous and then the trousers i think i did stick to a size eight as well now these was not in the tall range but when i seen them on the model the model's like five eight and they look quite good length on it and five nine 
So I was like, hmm, I got them and they do, they fit okay. They're not too far up my leg where I feel uncomfortable and I feel like they look silly. They don't, it fits really nice. So if you are five, nine and under, that is a brilliant little tracksuit set. I love the basic right now, I love that it's black. So easy to style and wear different ways. I really need more tracksuits and jogger sets and stuff, especially in this cold weather. You'll know if you've got a dog or you do a lot of outdoor walking. It's just freezing and sometimes you just want to throw something on and look put together really quick and easy without having to think. And I feel like these style of like joggers with like a nice blazer coat over or a nice puffer coat over or aviator just looks really smart and put together. Then I went for another grey cohort in my grey, like what is it with me and grey? I have become obsessed. But I've got this grey cohort and this is in a size 6 to 8 and this fits really nice. Once again, it looked quite long on the model. The model is the size 6 to 8. And it fits really well. I was in a little bit scared because I'm not six, but I didn't want to do the 10 to 12 and then have it really baggy on the legs because it's tight, the pants are like a tight fitting. Got a lovely waistband on them. They fit really nice. I love the polo neck style of this. I think it gives it much more of an elevated loungewear look. If you're working from home, this is such a gorgeous piece to wear because it looks like you put a lot of effort in when really you just sat at home in your comfies, which is what we all want. Yeah, I just love it. I love the way the pattern, the knitting goes down. Very elongating. I love it. I think it fits so nice too. The pants, the end just on my ankle or just below the ankle. So it's a really good fit considering it's not the tall range. Lastly, the last thing that I picked up from in the style, let me just fix the neck on it, is this little, is it, what do you call it? Shearling? Shearling, shearling style aviator. Sleeve, sleeveless aviator. I'm gonna go around the world to say what I'm gonna say. Sleeveless aviator jacket, and I love the beige and the brown. I think it's so so nice. I've got this in a size 10. I always size up in jackets. Sometimes I go quite a few sizes in jackets because I like them more oversized. I want to make sure they fit all my nice cozy jumpers underneath. But yeah, I think this is just a really good basics piece. Wouldn't say this is a capsule wardrobe piece because I feel like stuff like this can come in and out of style, especially with the colours that it is. But I think it's a lovely piece within itself i like the detailing i think i'm gonna get a lot of wear this for dog walk especially when the weather does start to warm up a little bit more this would be great just over a tracksuit so i actually did style it with this and i put that on underneath i know it's not something i would ever normally do is mix a gray with a beige and some of you might be like oh my gosh what is she doing but i styled it with this my coach bag and my new balance with the beige tick and stuff on i think it was actually quite nice a nice little go and grab coffee, walk in the dog, just nice, basic, easy wear that you can stick on and still feel put together. I like you put a little bit, little bit of effort into your outfit when you really just throw it on a set and a nice sleeveless jacket over the top. So guys, that is the end of my new in clothing haul. I hope you really like these pieces. As always, please let me know in the comments down below what you thought. Did you like these pieces? Did you not? Not your style? Do you want to see more dressier looks for January? Let me know and I will try and bring that for you guys in the next video. But as always, I hope you have a lovely week and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.